PowerPoint charts are an excellent way to show a trend, explain a situation, and support your message far more effectively than tables or bullet points. However, creating a decent chart in PowerPoint takes considerable amount of time, and formatting it takes even more time. This often leads to poorly designed charts, with some dismissing the idea of using a chart and instead dumping all the data in a table. So how can we create good-looking charts with minimal effort in the shortest amount of time? This brings us to the first tip. Here is a beautiful column chart showing sales for three items. At first, it looked like this. If you know you will need this type of chart in the near future, instead of recreating it all over again and taking more time to format it, like I did for this one, you can simply right-click on the chart and save it as a template. Later, if you need the same chart, go to Insert, Chart, click on Templates, select the template and OK. You will get the exact same chart. Just edit the series and categories and you are good to go. Another technique to make your chart look great is to avoid displaying the entirety of your chart, which can be overwhelming. Instead, you can use animations to control the sequence and the best way to do that is to start with the categories. If your chart has vertical and horizontal axes, you can start with those as well. Then use animation clicks to reveal the data points one by one, either in categories or groups. Now, if you are really busy but still want your chart to look amazing, a fantastic option is add-ins. For example, this one offers a collection of different charts and graphs. If you want a line chart, just click and drag and it will create one for you. How about a pie chart? Piece of cake. This add-in is not free, but it offers a trial period of 30 days and they did not sponsor this video. I hope this information was useful and valuable. I'll see you in the next one.